Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Car Mechanic Simulator. Now, in the last video, we done the Ford Mustang, the 2017 one, which is shown right in front of you here. Um, if you do want to check that out, click the top, the card in the top right corner now. Um, but we have finished the Ford DLC. Ah, but now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go on to the Pagani DLC. So we got the. Uh, Pagani Huayra here. Uh, I've got a bit of a cold, so my voice sounds a little bit weird. Uh, this is also the first video as well on Car Mechanic where I'm using my new mic. So hopefully it sounds uh, a lot better. But I don't have the voice to showcase it right now. Um, so what I need to do, I need to actually double check the condition of this car. Um, yeah, it looks like we need to dismantle the whole thing. Uh, let's move this over to the lifter and then we can take all the stuff apart uh, Front left door is that a window? Yes, it is Front bumper comes off the right door and this thing steering wheel comes off um what else do we need to do ah we need to take the tires off cuz we need to take out the gearbox which is there and then take out um, but to take the gearbox out of a rear engine car you actually have to take the tires off which makes sense it's just a little bit awkward there we go So what we're going to do, we're going to actually um, upgrade this as much as we can. Um, because what we're going to do, we're going to see how much um, horsepower we can get out. We're also going to put some fat tyres on it as well. Uh, starter, over here. Right, so that's the uh, V12 engine in there, actually. Uh, do I need to take out the turbo? I don't know. Um, we'll find that out in a minute. Uh, lift at A. Right, so the engine is gone now. Uh, right. Uh, I th yeah, that's it. A lot of these parts are, um, just acceptable. So, they're not perfect condition, but they are good enough. Um, but good enough is not good enough. It needs to be in perfect condition. Okay, so we need to actually lift the car now. There we go. We're in the air. Uh, knuckle housing's got to come out. Brake servos in the rear, which kind of makes sense, but doesn't make sense. Uh, 
There we go. Housing has been taken care of. Uh, we need to look in the engine bay. Oh, my nose. I'm ill. But I have to record a video because I don't have any more. Uh, what does it mean? I ah, engine. There we go. Right now we got to uh, remove all the front suspension and then we got to rebuild our engine. But we are going to be rebuilding it with max performance parts. Anything that says V12 in the performance shop we buy. Uh, we're putting in performance air filters, performance alternators, performance everything. So... And as well, I got a comment on, I think it was the uh, Mustang one, the old Mustang. I got a comment saying that there's apparently 24 spark plugs in this engine. So, yeah, not looking forward to that. Uh, but spark plugs are easier to put in than push rods, so... Uh, right, next tyre. Uh, we're also not putting... Uh, actually, we might make this a drag car. We'll make this one the drag car and make the Zonda R the racetrack one. We are definitely going to need some fat tyres for the Zonda R though. Because that car's already got like 800 horsepower in it. So... There we go, steering rack. Um, I think it's got both front and rear double wishbones, so we can sort that out in the next video, so we don't have to worry about it. There's that weird fuel tank again. The side fuel tanks. Right, let's go uh, put this. There we go. Radiators are out of the car. So we have done pretty much a large majority of the car now. Uh, what we need to do is now... Uh, I'm going to add the old one on. So as a standard alternator, it's got... Is that the power steering pump? V12 power steering pump. V12B, V12B. Uh, I think this entire engine is V12B. So um, we're going to add... No, we're going to create a new engine. I think it's the SOHC twin turbo. S, yeah, SOHC twin turbo. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Uh, part mount. Right, let's go here. Um, 
How is there no free space in the inventory? Right, let's repair these and then sell every single part again. The inventory literally has no space anymore. Uh, right. Inventory. Uh, oh, there's loads of Ford parts for some reason. Oh my gosh, this is insane. How many parts did I actually buy? There we go, Hawaii parts. Uh, right, so what we need is two of these air filters. Alternator is necessary. Uh, V12B, I don't know. 1,500 for a camshaft. Um, so we need the coil pack. Engine head V twelve B. There we go. Uh, exhaust manifolds. Uh, tell me we have V twelve B. We don't have V12B, but we've got V12A. So that should be good enough. Uh, let's take that. There we go, V12B intake manifold. Ten, eleven, twelve, one for luck, just in case I miscounted. Oh, we got Hawaii performance exhaust. That's good. Um, spark plugs. And then 10. 10. Because apparently it has 24. Okay, we should be good to start. No, we're not because we don't have the... 
Uh, engine block. We're gonna go V twelve. V12 crankshaft, V12 engine block. Okay, so they must be V12A exhaust manifolds. They've got to be. V12Bs. Uh, manifold cover. Right, we, um, oh yeah, we need, uh, rod caps as well. Uh, rod. And then crankshaft caps. There we go. Two, three, four, five, I think. Right, let's go with that for now. Uh, we need to uh, rotate the engine. Flip that over. Got ourselves a crankshaft here. Oh, piston rings. Nope. Ring. There we go. There we go, uh, that's two in. Only another 10 to go. There we go. Uh, rod caps. We've got loads of these to put in.
There we go. Right. Oil pan. And oil filter. Nice. Right. Let's rotate the engine back round the correct way up. Oh, I see what you mean by uh, loads of spark plugs. I only bought three camshaft caps. I need ten. Uh, Pagani camshaft cap. Oh, wait, I could put uh, cam gears in there. Wait, they're normal cam gears. I need another timing cover B. Uh, there we go. Turbo mounted, that is two turbos now, all together. Performance intake manifold. Performance fuel rail. There we go. Now the famous 24 spark plugs. There we go, that's 12 done. Um, oh, and our coil pack, can't forget about that.
It's ridiculous the amount of spark plugs in this. Four more to go. Two more. Come on. There we go. Oh, intercooler cover A. Intercooler cover B. And the coil pack. Alright, I think we're done with that. It's just the uh, rest of the timing circuit to do now. Uh, we need timing gear. So we need idle roller B, idle roller A, and two water pump pulleys. Idle. And then we've also got... And now we need a belt tensioner. Um, oh yeah, hang on. We also need our clutch release bearing. There we go, that's the engine built. So hopefully you guys did enjoy, sorry about my voice, uh, I'm ill, but if you guys did enjoy please leave a like, comment down below and subscribe and I shall see you next time, goodbye.